Welcome to Your Guitar Guide, the channel where I'm going to help you find your sound with guitar lessons, music, and gear reviews. And if this is your first time here, have a look around. If you like what you see, consider subscribing for more guitar tips and tricks. And let me say thank you for everyone that's already subscribed. Thank you for your support. And today, if you're a beginner guitar player, or you just bought a new guitar, or maybe you're just wondering, what guitar chord should I learn first? Well, that's what we're going to go over today. And that's coming up. Hello and welcome. I've got an easy chord for you today. If you're a beginner and you're wondering what guitar chord should I learn first, I've got you covered. So let's zoom in and let me show you this easy guitar chord. What makes this an easy chord is we only need two fingers to play it. And your second finger is going to go right here on the A string at the second fret. Right below that is your third finger right there your third finger is on the D string and your second finger is on the A string that's an E minor chord and besides the fact that you're just using two fingers to make that chord there's some things you want to do so that you're not touching any other strings and muting the strings out. See how they're all sanding properly? And if you look, you can see right through here, right here. To get that, you need to drop your wrist down. So if you're playing like this, your hand's against the fret, basically, all the strings. And you don't want your hand against the strings or you're going to be muting them. So what you want to do is take your thumb and bring it down. And just automatically, this changes the position of your hand. So you need room in between here, right here, and the bottom of the guitar neck. Another thing is... Hey, just real quick, if you like this video, can you click the like icon, give it a thumbs up, and that'll let YouTube know that you like the video, and they'll promote the video. Thanks. Another thing is, right here, you're playing on the tips of your fingers, right? Where, you can see where the calluses are on my fingers. That's where you want to be playing. If you're not playing there, you're going to run the risk of muting other strings and your chords aren't going to sound good. So play on the tips. When you play on the tips, you'll find that your first knuckle will be like this, bent. If, you, if you're like that, you're not going to be touch another strings and to find out if you're muting any other strings you can take each string one at a time and see if they ring out if something was touching another string it would sound like that I'm playing the E minor chord you're going to strum all six strings. So now that you know the E minor chord, if you want to learn another easy chord, check out the next video. Thanks.